How's it going, ladies and gentlemen on YouTube? I am Ultimate Speedway, and I am back at it with another video. Today, I'm going to be reviewing Kyle Larson's Hendrick Cars um, Next Gen Diecast. I'm going to pause the video and take the diecast out. Yeah, the diecast is out, and it is great to finally be touching this. That sounds weird, but whatever um on the hood we have hendrickcars.com and then we have five hendrickcars.com hiring technicians and then on the back we have hendrickcars.com there's the back hood and here is the other side i feel like these die casts now realizing it are a lot smaller um you know what that's the next one to be and you, I'm going to do a bit of a side-by-side -side comparison. You know what? Let me grab his other. Sorry. HendrickCars.com. Do like a legitimate side-by-side -side comparison. Because I didn't do these in any one of my other videos. You know. Um, sorry that this is so dusty. But the body on this is a lot smaller. You know. Then you look on the other side. And obviously the number placement is different. And then the back, it's just bulkier, I feel like. But like I said, this does have a Hot Wheels appearance to it. And I feel like other than that, this is looking... I do like this. I'm not the biggest fan of the tires. I will probably be purchasing a metal chassis. I don't know which one, though. I'd like to get one. Don't know which one to get. Um, let me know down in the comments which one I should get. I'm thinking the Chris Busher. Or Christopher. I think he's going by Christopher Busher now, Bob. Thinking that one. But I really do like this die cast. It is great to finally have this. The Larson fan this year has had so many ups and downs for him. You know, he starts off winning at Auto Club and then he crashes. And then he's come close. And he finally, finally won again, though, at my hometown track, Watkins Glen. I wasn't there. But it was great to watch on TV. And I watched both races. I watched them sweep that weekend. And it was great. But. Yeah this is a great scheme. Definite. A must get for Larson fans I will say. You know. Um, I feel like if this was any other year. I'd say hold off on this one because this is a lot, especially if you have last year's, but with this being the next gen, you gotta pick this one up if you are a Larson fan. I don't, he's not getting, I don't think he's getting as many schemes this year. Because he did last year, so. This one is a special one. But, yeah, let me know what you guys think of this down in the comments. Of course, if you're picking this up from Plan B Sales or Stir Gooby Diecast, be sure to use code ULTIMATE for uh, $5 off shipping, $30 or more. And thank you guys so much for watching. Please comment, like, and subscribe. Hit that bell so you never miss a thing. I am Ultimate Speedway, and I'm signing out. Peace.